Now, this show is called Carpet Remnant World. Uh, now, since I've been on the telly, I'm picking up a lot of stragglers, uh, people that don't normally uh, come and see me. There's twice as many people as I've played to uh, in Sheffield before here tonight. And um, the kind of people that come and see people just off the telly, the kind of shows you go and see by comics, they're normally called things like Laugh Time, aren't they? Or uh, <laughs> Jokerama 6, something like that. Um, now, if you've seen me before, and I hope you have, I don't like new people coming. Uh, you'll, you'll know, what I, my shows, they tend to be a relationship between the title and the content. That's the bare minimum of what you should offer, uh, I think. Uh, not so much this year, though. It's, uh, it's not really come together very well, this show. It was supposed to be about idealised notions of society and how we behave as collective groups and... Uh, but I've been a bit busy with one thing or another. It's not really uh, worked. So, but what I will do is about five minutes from the end, um, I, it's about 10 o'clock, I will, I will repeat the phrase, carpet remnant world, uh, over some music, and that will give the illusion of structure. And big, big laughs down here for that, people down here, the people who bought the tickets first, they've seen it before and they go, no, of course there'll be content and structure. We've seen him before, this is a comedic double bluff, ha ha, right? <laughs> but up there, there's a lot of people, they don't really know what they've come to, they've come... <laughs> Friends have bought them, they're the worst. <laughs> a couple of people that like me, they've, they've gone, well, let's get Gene and Chris to come as well. <laughs> and they've, not, they've, they've come and they don't know who I am and they've been whispering all through it up there, <laughs> in the top bit there. <laughs> Again, is this it? Is this who you wanted to see? Seems like an aggressive lecture. <laughs> it's very strong, and it will gradually that that whispering doubt that will spread all round the top <laughs> balcony up there, and that will be no one laughing up there by the end <laughs> because of people bringing their friends. And, the, and I was I was quite happy with one night in Sheffield, to be honest, because and you've brought friends along, and you can feel it's not as good as it was last time, <laughs> which is a shame because we're filming it tonight. So thanks. <laughs> Being on, I won some awards, British, that doesn't help, British Comedy Awards. Because people go, oh, he's won an award, we'll enjoy that. And you won't. <laughs> Winning a British Comedy Award is like having a big sign put over your head saying, hey dicks, come to this. <laughs> what can you do though? You can't, you can't stop people coming, you know. <laughs> It'd be all right, it's strong, strong down here. I'll just, I won't even look up there. I don't think. So we'll press on into the void. Now I thought I'd record this here because last time I was in this theatre it was really it was fantastic, but the audience is, we've got two nights now, more people come, but you can see it's a worse kind of person. <laughs> Shame. It's gone to all this trouble with all these cameras now. <laughs> oh, I come to Sheffield, it was brilliant last time. You know, it was, but it's, it's all right, isn't it? It's not very good. <laughs> Going well down here, isn't it? But up there. Because <laughs> people down here are thinking, oh, it's the kind of thing he does, and mucks about like this, it'll be all right. And up there, there's people going, oh, he doesn't, I've not seen him before, he doesn't seem to be able to do stand-up. <laughs> I can, I can do it really well, actually. <laughs> I'm really good at it. I'm so good at it, one of the things that I do, I make it look like I can't do it. <laughs> but I can. And if you're sitting there, having been brought by friends, thinking, oh, he can't, he can't do it, you have, the question you have to... I, I've, I've been on stage thousands of times, literally. You, the question you have to ask yourselves up there, people's friends, is how many times have you been to stand up and what kind of acts have you seen? It's maybe four or five times. You haven't seen the right sorts of people. You've got no context for me. So... <laughs> You're not in any position to have an opinion about it. <laughs> Good, that's warmed the room up. <laughs> It'll be all right, don't worry about it. Okay. So, on May the 2nd, 